<laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's so ucky. What am I focusing on? Oh, it's on and the bridge. It's bridge. <laughs> yeah, it's on the bridge. Mm, I like this white. But I don't like the... The pen, you The toti. Too much concrete. It's a little bit Right. Oh, am I, I never wrote it. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I didn't okay. rotate it. Eh, I thought I rotated already. Okay, now. Oh, yeah, and I tried to chase this chicken. To take the job. Yeah. Mm. But, but it's still not focused. Shut up. No, it's focused on the chicken, what? Is it not? Okay, sometimes, right, I really... Oh, but it kind of look like a painting if you look closer. So. Oh, he, he posed? Yeah, you never see his piece. I didn't. I was just like, oh my god, I hope I get this bunch of youngsters before they, they are gone. <gasps> the bunch of otters that are almost... Like, dude, you it's count. Really... You know they're sold out. Like what sound do they make? It's like a chirping sound. Like ti ti ti. I can't do. <laughs> Legit. I I heard them before I saw them first. Oh. Yeah. I think that's it. Thoughts. Can you follow me go see cameras? You are in different camera. Huh? You didn't tell me when. Since when? Okay, but sure. Where can you go? Uh? I think there's this shopping mall that has a lot. Peninsula shopping mall. Okay, shopping yeah. centre. I will go on there. You bring me? Uh. Sure. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. But I'm considering getting that one. MG1. But maybe not. Oh wait. I don't know. This one, MG1. Yeah. But they don't have a... At least I don't see. You have an exact model you're looking at? It's this brand. Yashika. Yeah. Interesting. But it's... It's not here, so I don't think they have. This is not the only shop, right? No, it's not. Oh, they really have a lot, yeah. Like a lot. But it says sold as. It says sold as. Is. Normally it means it's untested. But it's 279 for untested, yeah. yeah. But it's why you get 300 something for tested. Yeah, that's why. <coughs> I don't know. But this looks really, really new though. So why you do you choose for Yashika over everything else? Because my idol is... Your who? My idol. <laughs> Same thoughts. Who exactly is her idol? It's a 23-year-old Korean named Kim Hong Jung in a K-pop male idol group called Ateez. He takes photos with the Yashika Electro 35 GSN. Okay, I show you. I show you a picture of him using it. Like, this is the camera. Oh my god, honestly. Please, like... You want to buy a camera or because of your idol? Can then you look at how look it go how how good it looks? Like, dedication right there. I mean like if he uses it that means it's a good camera, right? <laughs> I guess. Like I have trust in this man only. Yeah. Trust over this man as compared to all the other like camera shop uncles. No, but like there's too many variety, so it's like I see he used then wow the picture looks good then okay I just you know but the idol use is a big it's a big plus point lah yeah because <laughs> I didn't know which one to choose just look here like there's so many how are you gonna choose which one that is like oh this is the one like you know how girls choose their wedding dresses they be like oh my god this is the dress then how are you gonna find the camera in like so many.
popular with young ones, they normally buy the uh, disposable camera. And then, uh, yeah, I think a lot of uh, youngsters are coming back with uh, with analog film, and uh, they do enjoy, you know, taking uh, analog than compared to digital lah. And then we have a lot of films here, as you can see, and we do also sell simple cameras. We want uh, more feature this one. This one because of panoramic uh, feature. Then you got self timer. Then you got soft lens. Forty two dollars. Oh. Uh, this one. This one also 42, this one also 42, this one 42, 42 lah. This one more oh, expensive lah, this one 85. Uh, this one also 42. Uh, this, uh, this one simple one, this is the simplest one, it's called the Big Finder, 32 lah. Uh, the model 32, also 42 dollars, but uh, less feature lah. This one is the most, uh, the most feature one, mm. and also 42. Okay, okay. Uh, Okay, I will look first. Uh, you go and see, see first. Uh, you and Mitchell start and Mitchell first. Later, then you can upgrade. Huh? Laura, what's up? Okay, okay. Okay, come back. Okay, no problem. Okay, thank you. Okay, then. Okay. I was thinking, like, I just buy one and then you see forever. Is that of like keep changing? Yeah, so I'm still thinking. Because I still haven't buy it, so I might change my mind anytime. We want to cater more for the youngsters, uh, more for the senior citizen who are, you know, say, oh, I want uh, just a simple one just to shoot, uh, just to record some uh, memories and so on. We will encourage them to buy a uh, reusable camera rather than, uh, what is it called? Rather than disposable camera. Lah. Our company is called Ruby Yay Photo. <laughs> Cheese! Hey, maybe I can check on those like Instagram film shops. Do you think they will have those? Maybe, but I don't think they have Yashika though, like all the ones that I want. Let's hear from Sam who runs this particular Instagram film camera shop, Film.io. At this point in time, they are craving something physical, so that's why film has made a return. And also, I think another factor is that when we look at um, digital photography and all. So digital photography has moved into like a space where there is a lot of pro post-processing required in Photoshop just to get the effects that you, you know, people would want to be able to um, post it on Instagram. And at a point in time, you are, it's a lot of work and it's a lot of skill involved as compared to like film where the colors, the effects, they are already like built into the film and it's, a simpler process, especially if one just goes to a lab, drops it off, gets the scans back. So I think for them, it's also um, partly is because it's more phys it's physical, it's slower, and also partly because it gets the effects that they want. Although it might be a bit more expensive, in, but for, to them, I think that's one. You need to know your limits. La. You cannot be like a 13 year old girl, then you see like, oh, your idols do this, your idols do that. Then you suddenly decide, oh my god, I want to be like this, I want to be like that, because you do it. You, get what I mean? you try like phone apps that has like filmy, grain, grainy effects thingy, instead of purchasing one first. And then if you really like it, then you can slowly like get into it. And maybe start with like disposable first. Then if you really like it, then you can slowly go get into it. I observe so many youths like us being interested in film, getting a film camera and shooting film. But to me, I just hope that this movement back to analog is sustainable and we truly think about it before getting one. Not just to follow trends, not because your friend or your idol is using it. Give it some thought, don't buy it in a spur of a moment and chuck it away after a few months. These vintage film cameras can last long if you cherish them, similar to those historical bridges that are conserved on the Singapore River. If one day you don't find yourself reaching out to film anymore, maybe you can sell them off on Carousel or even at Peninsula, and they'll probably take better care of it for you.